you're all having a great day today. Normally on Thursdays, I bring you either a tutorial or a haul, but since it's the end of the month, I thought I would bring you, get the drum rolls going, empties. Seriously, where has the month gone? It's like I just did it. <laughs> All right, so let's see. Now, of course, we look at our empties because you get a basket full of quick reviews, right? So let's get started. All right, now first, there's always a couple of these in my baskets, the cotton rounds, and this is a store brand, and this is Swispers. And, you know, I use them morning and night to take up my makeup off and to put toner on, so I go through a lot of these, which is good because I will, um, I purchased recently from Costco, and I will link that haul down below, but, I bought a huge thing full of the smaller cotton rounds and it should last for a while. My daughter and I are, we have enough to last a while. Well, let's hope so anyway. <laughs> okay, so that's those two. I have a Up and Up, which is a Target brand of the facial cleansing towelettes. Um, I do like these. I put them in my makeup table. This is what I clean my hands with while I'm doing my makeup because, you know, I just don't like the, to be dirty. So, um, I really like these. I have used these on my face, but um, generally I try to shy away from these using on my face because it just dries me out a little bit. So, love them on my hands and will repurchase. But right now, I have a drawer full of different packages of facial towelettes because I got them, got, I've gotten a lot for like free with purchase and things of that nature. So, I've got enough to last a while. And you know what? I've told a story because I do have one other one. This is the Walmart brand. And I like this one. The, the problem was the clasp on here. I had a hard time... Um, keeping that closed. So, probably just a defective package, but there again, for my hands, I like them both and will, would repurchase both of those. Okay, for dental, generally have one of these and it's the Crest 3D White. This is the Arctic Fresh. Love the 3D White and again from Costco, I did purchase a bundle of these. I believe it was four or five boxes and the price was insane compared to what I would spend in the store. And real quick, I have to say, if you can hear a quick dog bark here and there, I have to apologize. We have our standard poodle in the backyard. We just um, replaced, there was a sliding glass door back there and we replaced it with some French doors and there's some wet paint. So we just are having to keep her out and she can see me in here and she wants to know why she's not in, so she keeps barking. So. Sorry about that if you can hear her, which I don't even know if you can. So, guess I'll hear that when I go back and edit. <laughs> okay, back with dental. We have the 3D white, um, let's see, multi-care whitening rinse. Love this. Did repurchase. And love it, love it, love it. It's, um, the taste isn't one that's frightening but it's very it makes your mouth feel clean and smells clean and it helps keep those teeth white which is an awesome awesome thing okay still with dental i went through a bag of these glide scope outlast um mouthwash not mouthwash um floss picks <laughs> i'm stuck on mouthwash i've said before i much prefer the floss picks to having the string and you gotta do this with your teeth. I don't like that. So, finish these and absolutely would repurchase that. And that's the Oral-B Glide Scope Outlast. Love that. And for my son, who's seven, we use the picks as well for him. And he had a bag of Adventures. You know, has all the different characters on there, you know. You gotta keep it interesting for a seven-year-old or he doesn't wanna brush his teeth, right? <laughs> okay, so what is next? Oh, I have a one of the 
soaps that I ordered from Vitacost and I will link that haul down below and again Vitacost is on eBay so if you order from Vitacost to go through eBay you get money back on your purchase but this was a Dr. Bonner's uh, magic soap all-in-one hemp citrus orange pure Castile soap made with organic oils that was a mouthful. I tell you what, I love the soaps that I got from Vitacost. They do not dry your skin out. They get you very clean. Your skin feels clean without feeling dry. It is amazing. If you haven't tried them, go to Vitacost. Well, go to Ebates, then go to Vitacost and take a look at the oil, the, uh, the soaps, because they're vegan, um, organic, just pure soap and it's absolute they're beautiful beautiful products okay now cotton swabs again my daughter and i go through these and with the purchase of the swispers from costco i actually bought a box with it had three huge boxes of q-tips in it so there again we will be stocked up for a little while these are just plain q-tips i have them in my makeup table i use them daily along with the ones that have the point um just different uses for a different product but i absolutely love them have repurchased will continue i think i've always used q-tips so it's just one of those you know you figure products you know it's like it's just like part of your staple Okay, for hair, I got these samples, what was it, maybe from a Sephora purchase. It is the Swab Professionals, was it Sephora or was it Hope Look? I don't know, one of the two. But this is Swab Professionals Natural Infusion um, with... I'm not even going to try to pronounce that word. And then ginger and honeysuckle. <laughs> oh my goodness. But it had a shampoo, a conditioner, and a leave-in treatment. Now, I will say that when I was using them, oh, and it has does not have any parabens or dyes in it. So it's naturally better for your hair. But I will say when I was using it and directly after washing my hair, I was... I liked it. it was, my hair was very soft. As I've said before, I have a lot of hair and what I have is very thick. So, I mean, I normally use a lot of conditioner. Um, and, you know, there's not a lot in these little packets. So, I was amazed at how soft my hair was. But the next day and the day after, my hair started looking um, dry. So, you know, I don't know that um, I would use this again. I normally use a Redken product, which I love. And uh, but you know what? Like I said, when I was using it, I was I loved it. My hair was nice and soft. But days after that, just did not hold up very well. Okay, let's see. Next thing is something I purchased from Marshalls. It is the Argan Magic Cleansing Body Wash, and they have a uh, same size as this, and it's the lotion. And that I have not finished yet, but this is the body wash. It has a nice, um, let's see, it has a nice, you know, clean smell. And basically, I would put this on with my heavenly sponge that I have in my shower. And I like it. I use this all winter, and it really helped my skin. It kept it from getting dry and brittle, and it was amazing. I mean, it's not like going to be the most moisture you've ever had in your life, but for the for Dallas, Texas winter, it worked marvelous. And again, I purchased this from Marshalls along with the, it was a, duo the body wash and the conditioner still using the uh conditioner can't talk today lotion hello body wash and lotion okay next are two food items and these are um in case you don't know i'm doing that 30 day fitness challenge and 
Um, let's see, that's a whole video by itself. But these are two um, things that I purchased from Vitacost. They have everything. Yes, they do. Um, but these are Lara bars. These are, they take you down to minimal, minimal ingredients. I think the, um, let's see, I had one for pecan pie. And the only ingredients in the bars were dates, pecans, and almonds. Dates, pecans, and almonds. So if you don't like dates, don't get them because it's a strong taste. But I loved it. Pecan pie was my favorite. Loved it. Um, I actually had it in the kitchen so it, you know everyone could have them. I think I like them better than everyone else did. <laughs> and then I had a box of peanut butter cookie. No, it doesn't taste like a peanut butter cookie. Um, but, you know, it was pretty good. Um, this one had dates, peanuts, and sea salt. So, if I was going to purchase another box of Lara Bars of the two, I would get the pecan pie. But, since I ate the Lara Bars, I actually purchased Quest Bars because they have an insane amount of fiber, like 17, 18 grams of fiber for one bar. Can you believe it? And high in protein, and they're good. You eat it, and like for a morning snack or afternoon snack, keeps you full. I love it. But I don't have any empty boxes for that one. Okay, let's see. I'm just skipping around here for skincare. One of my Clarisonic brushes. I had had it for a while. It was old. It was time to get a new one. So I did. Okay, I went through a J.R. Watkins natural hand soap, and this is in grapefruit. I had this in my bathroom. Love it. I love the smell of grapefruit alone. Mmm, smells so good. I have another one of these soaps. I'm not sure of the scent in my bathroom now, and I love it. And yes, I definitely would repurchase, and I believe I got those from Target. Okay, so before I get into beauty, let me show you two more things. And this generally is in my empties as well. It's the Clean Care, my Holy Grail contact solution. This is what I use when my contacts are going to sit in here for at least six hours. Use it every night. Love it, love it, love it. Best thing in the world to clean contacts as far as I am concerned. Woo! Need some water. Okay, so next we have the Michael Todd True Organic Citrus Spray Hydrating Mist. I've had this forever. I've talked about it many times, and I finally finished it, and you know I bought another one, and I bought an extra one for someone very special, and I have not given it to her yet. So, um, yeah, I'm sharing the love on my Michael Todd products. <laughs> So I still use this every morning and every night after I use my toner. Love it, love it, love it, and we'll always repurchase. It'll be interesting a year from now to look back at this video and like, am I still, you know, what won't that be awesome? Like what products am I still using that I say I would use forever? Okay, beauty related. Let's see. And I'm trying to remember why this is in here. Okay, yeah. All right, first thing is the CoverGirl Outlast Stay Fabulous 3-in-1 Foundation. I had this in my drawer. I used it off and on. I really do like the product, but it expired. So I, I threw it away. So, yes, I would repurchase. It says it's 3-in-1, has um, foundation, let's see, lasting power of primer, coverage of a concealer and blendability of a foundation in one shine free and it has a broad spectrum SPF of 20 and I had the shade 810 so that is that and yes I would repurchase but I have not done so yet I have several foundations I'm trying to get through the next is great lash clear mascara you see how nasty that looks which is why it was in my empties bin. I use this to set my eyebrows. And generally speaking, I would be very good about wiping it off when I finished. Because if you do your eyebrows, if you have anything 
else on your eyebrows and you put this on there and you put it back in the jar, it gets it gooky and it gets it dirty just like it is now. And just one day I looked in there, I was like, oh. <laughs> so I just threw it in my basket and I have not repurchased. I'm still using my Anastasia Beverly Hills um, brow gel. Um, what is what is the color? Maybe brunette? I think so. But I like that. So I'm going to finish that before I get another brow gel. But definitely, yuck. That was nasty. Okay, this... I was very sad when it when I used it all up, and I used it up quickly because I use it every day. And it's the Dior um, Dior Show Maximizer Base Mascara Lash Primer. Love it! I loved it so much. I ordered a full size from Sephora, and I continue to use it every day. I love. It lengthens your your lashes, but so in a slight manner, so you don't look like you have, you know, enormous fake eyelashes on. But it it just does beautifully. I mean, if you're not going for the, you know, huge. I mean, just because you see some people that just have these fake eyelashes that are just enormous on their eyes. It's like how they can keep their eyeballs open. <laughs> And I'm just, I'm just jealous because I suck so bad at putting fake lashes on. So bad. So, I depend on things to make my lashes look good. And the Dior Show does it. Love it, love it. Okay, next thing we are moving along is the CoverGirl Ink It Eyeliner. And this is in the color Black Ink. This was a duo with the CoverGirl mascara. has like flame looking things around it. And I really like the mascara. But this dried out so fast. I probably only used it twice. And it was dry. I don't know if it was just a bad batch. But yeah, didn't don't care for it. And when I did use it the one or two times, it just... Um, it didn't glide easily, and it was just, you know, not a very comfortable product. So, I would not repurchase the CoverGirl Inked It Eyeliner. Okay, last but not least are my masks for the month. So, there aren't that many, so we won't be here too long. Um, the first one is, um, sorry if the color is getting weird on the video. It's getting very gloomy outside and I'm by some very large windows. So, okay, well, let me just wrap this up. This is the facial brightening paper mask in the rose. I talked about this on one of my favorite, on my Saturday standouts, I think, and this was a flop big time. Just, it made my face itch so bad. I had to wash my face after I used it. Uh, just to get it off and this was actually a, an extra one that I had didn't even open it just chunked it in the trash just will, would not purchase this again I bought it from Walmart okay next mask I have a forever luminous hydrating facial wrap with coconut and shea butter loved that very much and I purchased that from Marshalls and another forever luminous this is a decollete mask. I used this when I went to Atlanta and I liked it. My husband didn't go with me. And so it's like I had a face mask on, I had a mask on my chest, and I had foot foot mask on. <laughs> that was a sight for sore eyes, that is for sure. Okay, also from Marshalls, I got two Maskology mask let's see that's anti-aging with hydrolyzed elastin both of them so it's the same thing and all of these masks are just one use but I like I really like these and again for Marshalls you can't beat the I'm telling you I go into Marshalls and go straight to the beauty area when I'm when I'm need to purchase the mask just because that's the best place that and TJ Maxx Max. You can buy a box of four masks for like $3.99. That is insane, and they're good 
mask. Good mask. You don't have to pay a lot of money. Okay, now I said before I used a foot mask, and this was it. The Petty Patrol Repairing Foot Mask. These were very, very interesting. It was like if you got the most crinkly sounding baggy and put your feet in them. It, it was so funny because someone actually knocked on my door and by in error, but I, as I'm walking to the door, it was like, <laughs> it's like I can't sneak up on anybody with these things. They were crazy, but you know what? My feet were so soft when I took them out and Marshalls, yes, got those from Marshalls as well. Okay, only have two martini masks this time, and both of these were two uses. So each pack was a two use. Um, this is the, oh, you know what? No, I beg your pardon. These were not two, because these were the collagen mask. So these are the ones that's it's rubbery. You have a part that goes over your eyes and then a part that goes over your mouth. This is the caffeine collagen mask. Love, love, love this one. It says it's for mature and sun-dried, sun-damaged skin. Facial slimming and wrinkle fighting. Girlfriend, please. Facial slimming and ankle slimming and uh, ankle. <laughs> Wrinkle fighting. Honey, I need to buy some more of these collagen, caffeine collagen. Okay, last thing is a coconut collagen mask. And I really like that one too. And that was for dry and sensitive skin soothes and revitalizes pale skin. Loved it. I love both of these. They're both um, very, very easy on the skin. I have never had any skin irritation ever. Unlike that rose mask. That was horrible. So, love, love, love the mask. And again, masking is an excellent way to fight aging. Because I will fight it forever. <laughs> Alright girls, that was it. The basket is empty. And it is time to fill it up again. So what have you gone through this month? Leave it down below in the box. And if you haven't done so yet, look down there. You can't miss it. There's a little red button that says subscribe. Hit it. And let's be friends. This Saturday I will do another video of my April favorite. So stay tuned for that. Hope you're having a great day, a fun day, and it's always a safe day. Talk to y'all soon. Bye.